Welcome to my Halloween special, although I feel like I'm missing something. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> hmm, where have you been? Oh, I was gardening. That won't do. Oh, hello, Aunt Suki. How you doing? Oh. <laughs> here we are. Look at that. Oh. How did I get here? Well, you know, magic. Oh. <laughs> Today we're going to be making chocolate cupcakes with pumpkin frosting and something that the kids can make as well, a little monster face. The ingredients for the cupcakes are... One cup of wholemeal flour. One cup of almond milk. Three quarters of a cup of mashed banana. Quarter of a cup of cocoa powder. Two tablespoons of raw sugar. Half a teaspoon of baking soda. One and a quarter teaspoons of baking powder. And one and a quarter teaspoons of cinnamon. So I'll sift the ingredients. So we're putting in our flour, cinnamon, cocoa powder, and our baking powder and soda. Not the sugar, because obviously it's, it's too fine to go through. <laughs> I seem to have lost some of the ingredients. <laughs> well, it's a bit of a mess, but blindly, when did I clean this place? Look at the spiders! I know, it's oh. crazy! Remember when you're sifting whole grain flour that you're going to be left with the bits, and that's fine, you're going to put the bits back in with your mix, but you're sifting it to make sure that everything is, in, is nice and fine that it can be. Especially the bicarbonate of soda. Yeah, exactly, because that ends up being in balls. And... Right, so before we put this back in, you can see that there's no big lumps of baking powder or soda at all, and we're just going to put that in with the mix. Right, then we're going to add in our sugar. What sort of person looks after this kitchen? I don't know. <laughs> Should I get rid of all yeah, these cobwebs? Yeah, I think we might need to get rid of the cobwebs. Oh. That's underneath it. Ah, so fun. <laughs> now, obviously I've already mashed that up. It does equal exactly three quarters of a cup of banana. That was two medium-sized bananas that that made. Then do you want to add the milk? Mm -hmm. Can you do it that's going? <laughs> I never spill a drop. <laughs> Not one drop, look at that. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to turn it on and we're going to blend it until it's smooth. Not long, about 30 seconds if that. So you're going to pour that in. Oh, nice nail varnish. Oh, thank you. Thank you for noticing. Mm. That's what our mixture looks like. Okay, you want to fill up your cupcake moulds to half. <laughs> <laughs> Meow, says Mateo in the background. We're going to put these in the oven for 10 minutes. These ones take 10, these ones take about 12 minutes, depending on your oven. It will be at fan forced, heat top and bottom. Just melted some chocolate and put it in, into a piping bag. I wanted to make spider webs, but it's too runny. So I'm going to do some sort of designs that will be spider web-ish. <laughs> okay, here's for freehand, freestyle, spider web issues. <laughs> for the pumpkin frosting we will need. One and a half cup of pumpkin puree. Half a cup of dates, and today I'm using normal dates, not the dual dates. Third of a cup of cashews, about half of a teaspoon to a teaspoon of vanilla, depending on how vanilla you want it. A quarter of a teaspoon of nutmeg. Right, we're going to pop that in the blender and blend it up. You could do this in a food processor, of course you could. Uh, so we're going to get the tamper in there and turn her on. I'm actually going to put a lucky band on top. Like this. I'm just going to put that in the fridge for a little bit. All right, our cupcakes have cooled down completely. Do you want to have a go? No, I'll leave this all up to you. Oh, no, I think you should do your big ones, Mum. I'll do one. 
one. Excellent. That one looks like a cat. All right, so there we've got a oh, pretty artistic yes. <laughs> Halloween cupcakes. Okay, all right, so now we're going to be making monster faces out of fruits, uh, dried fruit and nuts. Yeah, so we're going to basically cut up some stuff and assemble it on our platter. And we're going to do sort of like really, really long big chunks. And we're doing it like this because it's going to be the mouth of our monster. This one's a bit wobbly so I might just take a tiny bit off the back. It's like a little cut it. Possibility. How are you going there? Nice and thick. We're going to make a monster face here and then we're going to have bits of monster like maybe an eyeball or a mouth or something around on in different places in the planet. So we're going to start with the two best kiwi fruit pieces which I think oh, that the are eyes. here, that's the eyes and then this is the best mouth. So we, we've got sort of that organised. And our pepitas are going to be our rotten teeth. Ah. So this guy's got terrible hygiene. He hasn't been to the dentist for a very long time. And his teeth stick straight out. <laughs> He's got some serious teeth problems. I'm going to get a cashew. This is a big one, it's good. I'm just gently going to split that in half. We'll flip that open and then that becomes his horns. <laughs> this guy can have a, these guys can have like a one single horn thing coming out of their head. Look at that. <laughs> I'm gonna be his spur. So what was the thing that you were scared of the most as a kid, Mum? The doctor. <laughs> he was mean. Well, he, he, I used to run and hide up if I know who's coming. Because they, they used to do home, house, visits, home, home visits. visits. Yeah. Well, I was scared of big purple, uh, purple big bird. <laughs> really? Yeah, I there was a no, he lived, he lived outside my window when I was a kid. In your head? <laughs> I was a kid, he lived outside the window. <laughs> Okay, so basically a fruit platter, a scary monster face fruit platter. And I picked up these little, uh, the pretty cute pumpkin toothpicks that I thought you could pick the berries up with. I'll try this little one here. <laughs> mm. Oh my gosh, no. I need to show you inside, I think. So you can see how beautiful it is. Really, really nice. They just don't taste like a whole meal to me. I, I no, don't eat them, and not for a second do you think that doesn't have butter, oil, eggs, a whole lot of refined sugar in it. No. Um, it would just taste yummy. Cheers. Mm. Happy mm. Halloween. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you again next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>